Hey guys, Boy Max here, here, and welcome back to another episode of Sora Storka. I understand it's been a few months since I played this, but don't worry, I haven't forgotten it. I have planned to come back just after I finished school and such, but I just completed a Doom Blade mod, TR to drain my and stuff, so I wanted to come back and refresh my mind with some other games instead of Shining Force. So last time we cleared out the Tower of Heaven or something like that, imaginary numbers, something like that. I, I don't really remember. I know, I think that's the last dungeon, but yeah, we went to some tower and we got some airship. We're supposed to be going to the last place in the game. But before that, I did want to go to the Source Dorka shop and get some the best equipment armor because that's where I can get it at. So today we'll probably clear out those two dungeons and find the other mystical monsters because there are like three or four extremely powerful monsters I wanted to fight before I face the final boss just for some extra equipment and stuff. So yeah, let's go. So I guess we'll just buy the special dungeons. I'm banning Fortress King Coat of Arms. Save our game. The funny thing about this is this game only has I only have five hours on this game. So you can really beat this game in literally one day. That's how easily you can beat this game. I've had seven hours of Final Fantasy each to beat it in two days. That's how fast you can beat these games. I know now you're supposed to be playing for seven hours straight, but I was just so excited to play Final Fantasy. Anyway, let's go see a little monster right here. I tried to find him, but I got wrecked, so I'm going to get that good equipment. Let's go to this dungeon first. What is this run down old fort? It looks like an abandoned old fortress, but I've never heard of any military outpost in this area. <coughs> now sound like a woman's scream. I think he came from inside. Let's go have a look. Oh no! That lady's about to get snatched by those monsters! Look at his butt cheeks. Ah, travelers, help me! Help me, please! Dinner! She'll be killed! Let's go rescue her! The monsters took her into the fort. He must pursue her. He must get pursued immediately. So, um, yeah. Looks like I'll go see this girl from these monsters. Bye. These monsters will be very easy to kill since. Um, I'm supposed to be level 15 or above to fight them, but obviously I'm like way above their level, so this dungeon will probably be really easy to clear through. As you can see, I'm like one-shotting most of them, all of them. But yeah, you know, I love Kimco's games, but I feel like some of them are either really good or it's really bad, or most, most of them are mediocre at best. Hmm, I could go there, but I want to see what's around here. Okay, we got the first strike. Because we're pretty fast. I did try to do some grinding, but I mean, it takes way too long, so we're most likely above or over leveled or something. Is there anything over there? Probably not, actually. Let's put on our big boy boots, our safety boots, so we don't get damaged when walking across these floors. Yeah, my voice it sounds a lot better since my allergies haven't come back. But they will be back in about maybe a month or two. Let me tell you, it's the worst thing ever. I feel like you're going to die. Alright. This dungeon will be pretty easy to wipe wipe off forever. Yep, I do need to go down here to press the button. Probably like an entrance to another room or something. So yeah, school is starting again in a few days. I did, I decided to do that Doomblade Challenge mod just so you guys have something to watch before I left for a while. But um, yeah, let me tell you that mod, at first it was actually really fun. I enjoyed playing it. But then after like the second half of the game, it was just not even fun anymore. I did have fun in the last chapter though. You know, it was incredibly difficult. It was fun figuring out how to like defeat Rambo do and stuff. But like I said, I don't want to talk too much about that. I want to focus on JRPGs more. Yeah, like my, I know my whole channel is dedicated to Shining Force, but I like playing other games too. Yeah, let's do random attack.
So oh, there goes the little hit point. That's where the boss must be at. Yeah, this thing is going to take a while. Not only because of battles, of course, but because it's just walking around. I have actually planned to play another tactical game. Come cause another one. I don't remember what it's called, but... Uh, yeah, I can't really remember it, but... It's a really good SRPG game. I played it. I'm beating it. I think you guys really like to watch it. it it's pretty good. So I will be playing that one too. Yeah, it's like most of the most of the chemical games I played to me are unique. They're not like the same game over and over again. That's not saying that chemical games are bad because they're not, but I feel like some of their games have like declined in quality over the past few years. They're not really that good anymore. Oh, let me put my boots on again. I, mean, I think we'll be fine, actually. We really don't need to, we don't need to put these boots on, because the enemies don't really get to attack us. And if they do, it's going to deal with nothing anyway. I can just put on auto for this battle. Might as well, honestly. And I know some, no one's really going like to say it, but this is technically going to make the game too easy. Oh, what? What's this? Oh wait, yeah, I know what this is. Never mind. I didn't give us like a fighter skill or something like that. Sorting. I mean, no, it's the automatic sorting. Where is it at? Oh, it's probably in key items. Yep. Okay. I'm going to give it to Uber. Okay, you can learn Phantom Pain, Smash Move, now Floyd. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Sonic Boom is really good. Sonic Boom, learn that. I'm gonna move it up here so I don't accidentally end the video or something. There we go. I really like how this recorder has like a... Well, I well, I do like I do like that it'll allow me to record my own voice. I don't like that I have to have my voice in the video just to record it. It feels kind of strange. And I looked at other screen recorders, and most of them have this option. You have to have your microphone enabled, which is stupid. But it was definitely worth it, getting that fighter tune, that tone. Oh, here come these guys, so I can get some more Soul Stoker points. No! No! Alright, kill him. Kill him. Kill a Silver Lantern, please. I need that. Oh crap, that's not good. Don't leave, don't leave. Don't leave. Oh, she's charmed. She's charmed and he's dead. Uh, I'll revive out in the battle. I didn't really notice that. And she's going to kill herself. And we're screwed. And you gotta be kidding me. I didn't get anything. I died from nothing. Thankfully, I have some use in hand. So we should be fine. Uh, that was stupid me. If only I had it, I probably wouldn't be able to kill them anyway because they dodge like crazy. But they give you a lot of points. I think it's like 30 for every one you kill. I'll be able to get like 60 out of that. I think that game I was talking about, like, Legion or something like that. I don't remember. It's been a while since I played it, but it was a really good game. It was 3D, too.
If they made Legend of Xtona 2, I would definitely play it. I love Legend of Xtona. It's like my favorite SRPG on the App Store. Oh, I gotta change this um, thing then. Yeah, I'm gonna have to change the souls. Uh, it looks like you're a dark warrior now. Oh. Alright, I'll, I'll, I'll come back. I'll come back later. I'm gonna grab some equipment, so I'll be back, guys. I need to buy him some armor. Alright, I'm back. I got him some new equipment, and I got Ibis the Sword, and she's an offensive class now. So, um, yeah, let's keep exploring. Well, I do like that I get these dungeons. I feel like it's really stupid that you can get the best equipment this early. That's like, no, I know that Chemco does this. They do it on purpose. And they're not sneaky. They'll force you to get the best equipment and everything by making you go through a paywall or something like that. But thankfully, they have enough mercy to sometimes, well, most games, some sometimes they're more merciful. Like Soul Storica will give you a secret enemy that's rare, but it gives you points so you can use in a shop. And some games you have to kill a thousand enemies for ten points, which will take hours and hours. Which, let's be honest, I'm not doing all that. I don't have time to, for six hours to kill some enemies. I'm patient, but I'm not that patient. But, yeah, why we really like what this game is, it's fair enough where you just have to find some really rare enemy, kill it, and then you get points to go to special shops. But if we're going to get this best equipment, I feel like we should really get it near the end of the game or mid-game. Not just like do the best equipment early on. And then the game would be boring because you could smash through every single enemy in your way. And then yeah, the game really wouldn't be fun. It would just be like a cake box. But yeah, that was just my little rant, I guess. It's not really important. This boss fight would probably be really easy too. But, yeah, this, I, I, I will record longer videos, but there's two, there's two big reasons. I'll record that ship episode where I was inside the ship of the knights. Um, yeah, I was inside the fleet. My phone crashed, and I lost all my data on this game. So, I'm fearful of recording long videos on your two to lose all my data. Even though this game really is not long, let, let's be honest. Three endings? Um, yeah, three endings. I think someone told me, forgot their name, energy, something like that. They told me I had to play this game three times to get all endings. So there's most likely a third ending, a secret one. So, was five, let's say this game takes seven hours, seven times three, was it 21 or whatever? 21 hours? No one has time for that. And another reason is that these videos, since these, since these videos are in heck high quality, um, it takes a lot more storage. When I record those Shining Force videos and such on rich live streams, they don't take up a lot of storage. The most you'll ever get is like 200 megabytes for like a 30 minute video. And the reason is, the quality is pretty darn bad. But you can tell in these videos, the quality goes up to 480p, which is pretty good for a phone. And I'm actually recording this at 720, but I guess YouTube only allows me to go to 480. But since it's a pretty high quality, and I like to put out high quality videos, so you won't look like garbage, it's going to take a lot more storage. And it takes, most of the videos get like at least one gigabyte, which is a lot, and it takes like an hour to upload the video, which is very annoying. So that's why I don't like recording long videos. Uh, so it's either sacrifice quality over quantity, which I'm not doing that. Oh yeah, Arya has got 1 HP. It's alright, he's not going to die. I'll probably use him in my next playthrough a lot more. But yeah, I guess that's all I have to say for right now. Not really much to come to this channel. I'll just be, in, I'll just be inactive for a while. 
I might still upload here and there, but I miss what they learned. I'll, I'll proceed in battle. But I will still be on YouTube, of course, but it's probably not uploading as much. And Christmas break, I'll probably come back on Christmas break or like whenever I get a day off of school an extra day. I might upload like a video or something. Well, that's really it for now. Thank you for watching my videos, whoever you are. Alright, I guess it's time for the boss fight. Nope, not yet. Still got to open one more door. Press another button. And right there, I do want to say one more thing. When I do the second playthrough, I will be cutting out everything except until I get until I get to the part where um, you know the ship crashes. Because the gameplay is going to be the exact same until I get to that point. So in reality, there's really no reason to report it all over again. So this will be like the only playthrough that actually has the beginning to end content. But right now, basically, yeah. So that way you don't, have to, you don't have to watch everything all over again because who wants to? What's the point? And everything's going to be the same up until at one point. I got a wither down. I'm giving this to York. Meter impact. Yeah, let's get that. That's a really good skill. I guess I'll just do. I guess I'll just do this one dungeon for now, and, and then uh, the next episode might come out tomorrow. Ouch! There's the last button, boys. Let's get it. After I do complete this, uh, with a scout come nice. Let's give. Let's give that to York. Blood sword. Definitely no. Mmm. Mirage bite. Oh, I hate it when he do that. What? I just used it? Oh, yeah, I already used it. I'm so dumb. Um, yeah. I, I'm never freaking overuse that skill. It was so annoying. I was rage quitting over that. He dodged every attack. You just had to sit there and suffer. Okay, this isn't too bad. I think I might come back to that, um, Aeon Avenger or something like that. Yes, I pirated the game. I will admit, I pirated it. I no longer pirate games. I now just buy them. But, um, yeah, I will come back to that. So, for anyone that likes Kemco games, you will probably like the content that I have out, that I push up too. Or to upload. Ooh, we got a gold one. Don't leave. Don't, do not, don't leave. Please don't. I really need, I really need these points. Any left. Dang it. Don't leave! Please don't. Please don't leave. Come on, like three more hits on this guy, he's dead. Three more hits. Yes! Like, did I get 30? 100! Oh my god! Wow. 100. I also get like at least 60. No, they must be extremely rare for that. If I kill, if I kill another one, I another one hundred. But wow, well, that's a lot. I can finally complete this dungeon. Chroma Energy. That was her name. I remember your name now. Level up. Alright. Um, it's time for us to heal. Let's go. I'm not really scared because the boss will be easy to pummel. And another random encounter. And I have to walk down these stairs again. Say one more time.
This is the back of the fort. Where is that woman who was taken away by monsters? I hope she's not already in the monster's bellies. Hot oh, travelers, you really can't rescue me? It's a trap. Good, you're all right. But how do you get away from those monsters? Yes, well, the monsters started to argue over which one was going to get to eat me first. So that's when you ran away. You truly are fortunate. Anyway, we should escort you back home. Where do you live? I have a little mountain hut not far from here. Ah, oh, yes. I'd like to give you a token of my appreciation. So could you please stop by my home? I'll prepare a delicious meal. We are the meal. And let me guess. Where are the ingredients? Exactly. What? You can drop the app. I've already figured out you're, you're, that you're a monster. What? What are you talking about? Look, I'm a human. You may look human, but there's more to it than that. You're taken away by monsters. Look at you. Not even a single scratch. Not only are you going to injure but your clothes aren't even dirty. That's just not possible. That's a coincidence? So it is a coincidence that you're wearing such flimsy clothing. It's rather the fact that you live in a mountain hut? You're not just like someone used to living in the mountains. <laughs> <laughs> I see. So all this is common sense for a human. I'll have to remember all this stuff for next time. If you're all so smart, then why did you know enough to run? Humans are so strange. Simple. You have no reason to run away from a, such a wimpy monster such as yourself. Anyway, we won't let you trick people anymore. I'll be ready for a fight. Hmm. <laughs> Imputed human. You got quite a mouth on you. I'll tear it open so you can't use it anymore. Here we go. Tindalos and Diablo. Uh, okay, yes. Wow. This is going to be really easy. Critical hit. <laughs> this is my favorite skill. It's just so good. Wow. Yeah, this is too easy. Of course, it's too easy. I'm like way over level for this. No, I'll, I'll just end this quickly. I'll always use auto at this point. I'm just going to go out on like three more hits, by the way. Oh, that was really easy. Then I'm told soul. <laughs> so that takes care of that. What a waste of time. At least now, no more people will be tricked to eat by that monster. That's a good way of looking at it. Alright, we still have things to do. True, let's go. Let's get these really, let's get this cool equipment, I guess. Soul armor. Wow. I'll be giving that to York, of course. Because he's my favorite character. And soul coat. Boom. Wow. Well, it's really good, of course it is. Oh, I definitely had another one. I didn't know that. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. I see him. Makes sense. Alright. Alright. Yes, I'm sorry, guys. This is a short episode. But I will be going to the next dungeon to get the... I think it's a Pirate's Bay or something like that. I'll be getting the strongest equipment. And after that, we'll be facing the strongest monsters. Like the four special monsters. And then we'll go to the region of imaginary numbers. Thank you for watching, guys. Move to the channel. Make sure to hit that bell. Like, share, subscribe to the video with your friends. And I'll see you guys in the next episode.